So now let's look at the diaphragmatic surface of the heart, the inferior surface of the heart, if you wish. And this is made up of the lower part of the right ventricle. There's right ventricle, comes around like so. And it's made up of, there's the left ventricle, and the left ventricle coming around like that. So the diaphragmatic surface, the inferior surface of the heart, the two ventricles. We now talk about the posterior aspect of the heart, the base of the heart. Now, you see, we've talked about the right atrium. There it is, right border of the heart. We've talked about the ventricles. There they are, anterior aspect inferior or diaphragmatic aspect. I've only shown you up to now this little tiny bit of the left atrium, the auricular appendage of the left atrium. And the reason is that the left atrium, for practical purposes, is back here, the base of the heart, the posterior aspect of the heart. Posterior aspect of the heart. There it is there. So if there's my heart in me, and there's the posterior aspect of the heart, turn it round, left atrium. So let's just recapitulate. Anterior aspect of the heart, right atrium, right ventricle, low pressure, left ventricle little tiny bit of the left atrium auricular appendage coming around there. Inferior aspect of the heart, diaphragmatic surface, the two ventricles. So that leaves us with the base of the heart, the posterior aspect of the heart, there where my hand is. You see, up to now I've talked about the right atrium, right ventricle, left ventricle, little tiny bit of the left atrium, the left auricular appendage. So do you see the posterior aspect of the heart, the base of the heart, the thing the heart's lying on as you lie down in bed or the patient lying on the operating table, turn it round like that and what you're seeing there is the great bulk of the left atrium. That's where you find it, the posterior aspect of the heart, the base of the heart. So we're going, uh, we've talked about the, uh, the uh, external appearances of the heart and the chambers. We're now going to open the heart and look at the internal structure of the heart and the valve system. And for this, we're going to dim the lights. <laughs>